and gas. You oh yeah, you've beaten the game. I have, I have. not beaten the game. Yeah. Those are peanuts. Pajama Sam, why? Okay, I'm not the cleanest guy, but I draw the line at like food. Just food line left out. over. Another car. I feel like his mother should know about this. <gasps> the hero sandwich. Hero Sandwich is the leader of the Lunchboxers, an informal association of food-related superheroes. He spends much of his time at the Lunchboxers headquarters doing experiments in a secret refrigerated crime lab. Hero Sandwich first appeared in issue 71. That's not my baloney. Hero Sandwich is weakened by cheap mellow yellow mustard. As am I. I hate, yes. I hate cheap yellow mustard. Yellow mustard sucks, but like grain mustard and spicy mustard can yeah. be good. Yeah, but also just plain old like <laughs> mustard on the hot dog. So Hero good. Sandwich also appeared for two seconds in Pajama Sam 2 when Earthquaker was making the earthquake and he went <laughs> I do remember that. <laughs> That cheese is moldy. The sponge would love that. But now yeah, it's blue cheese. cheese. Peanuts in that bag. I bet nobody would notice if one was missing. Pajama Sam, this is your room and your food. I bet nobody would notice. Pajama Man, Mrs. Uh, Pajama Sam is uh, enabling him and his bad behavior. <laughs> I do wonder if this child had just poor direction, where they were like, "You need to kind of sound like this," but because of that, they couldn't speak loudly. And Maybe. They, and then if they increased the volume, it would have been like. <sighs> That like, with the it. background sound. But also, we had the moral of don't be messy in Pajama Sam Lost and Found. Yeah. I can't catch them with my hands. I need something bigger to catch these bugs. To be fair, I'm not blaming the child on their acting performance in this game. Like, no, no, no. Child, you're fine. Child, you did the best job with I your have, direction. I have some questions for the producer and, and the director. The hiring director, and yes. maybe. Although, that's fine. <laughs> although so far I haven't seen any playtesting errors, like the game is running, you know. The, they might have fixed a lot of those bugs for the Steam release. Oh, uh, that's fair. Because yeah. this game was not very stable. When we played was... Putt Putt, it was like remember people's faces flying off and. I do, yeah. We haven't had anything like that yet, or the game crash. Hey, we got Happy the net record. though. I like how this sad sock has just been I with us the whole time, not saying a word. The fireflies go right through. Well, oh man! Well, hey, sock, sock, catch these for us. Now that's just silly. Oh really? What do we do with the funny putty? Oh, oh my gosh! Yes, lasso one. I'm pretty sure that's not going to work. Into the jar. It wouldn't be nice to put the fireflies in my jar until. What I are we supposed to do then? The they need holes so they can breathe. So put, that's put fair. The, so put the hole. We don't have like a hammer and nail or anything. <laughs> Oh, um, you, wait, wait, um, what? I'm sorry? You hit the... You jumped down, so you hit the the pile. And the Hi, pile. welcome back, <laughs> stupid <I'm> sponge! sponge. <laughs> <laughs> I never get visitors! <laughs> yeah, because they have to... Oh, no, now we have to get the California raisins to bring us I back up again. Just, I think you can just go up, and then you don't have to throw them. Oh, hey! There you go. Hey. Well, let's go to close. Oh, I remember this lady. I remember oh. that disgusting turtleneck that you threw what, away. Oh, what a nice me. young man you are. I'm Grandma Sweater. I'm almost through with this copy of Knitting Weekly if you want to borrow it. No, thank you. I don't knit. You don't knit? <laughs> oh, that's a shame. In the good <laughs> old she days, everyone family. liked to knit. I wish I could knit. Because I sure could use a shirt. <laughs> well, since I, I only have pajamas. It, I'd be glad to knit a shirt just for you if you bring me some yarn. Oh, I sure we will be killing some dust. I can't believe like a young six-year-old boy doesn't want to knit. Any what is that sort of yarn sock, we'll by the way? What the? That? Whole, yeah. Ah, what the heck is that? It's a pair of pants that only got one leg. <laughs> but the other one's like stubbed. Actually, that might be like for uh, a pair. like for prosthesis or something. Oh, how very inclusive of them. For 2003. Hey, look, another trading card. <laughs> That's you. <gasps> Dr. Grime. Dr. Grime is Pajama Man's oldest and dirtiest enemy. He's the lord of all that is dirty and putrid. He has sworn to rid the world of cleanliness and spotlessness. His main power is that everything he touches gets dirty. Dr. Grime first appeared in issue number one, The Secret Origin of Pajama Man. Fun fact, Dr. Grime isn't a real doctor. Wow, you could have fooled me. <laughs> I'll be honest, I think Pajama Sam should just go get the signature from Dr. Grime because of how dirty his room is. Yeah, literally. 
Also, uh, Dr. Grime bears a striking resemblance to Crud from the many new adventures of Winnie the Pooh. I forgot about Crud. Oh, the eyes. The eyes Hello. are so weird. Hello. 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 That's for the wide pipe. Yeah. But That's it has it. an extra hole. <laughs> Just in case. Or for so for someone, or for lanky calm. <laughs> yeah, extra long arms. My name's Sam. What are your names? Why are there so many Hello. zippers on that? Hello. Hello. Oh my gosh, Grandma's sweater is making clothes for Sora for the next Quick and Kingdom Hearts game. No, they're not plaid enough. Grandma's no, but they've got so many zippers. <laughs> oh, that's true. Yo-yo string won't work. I was playing Kingdom Hearts 2 the other day. Leon has like seven Can zippers on his outfit. With this funny putty, Grandma? Funny putty? Oh my stars. Goodness me. Well, why not? Okay, here goes. <laughs> My heavens, will you look at that? It's my exact shape and size. Now we can just trick the security guard and figure we have a sweater. <laughs> that would be funny. Do, 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 what do, do we have to funny putty? Oh, uh, we'll have to do it for some time. Oh my gosh. That's how we defeat Dr. Grime. <sighs> yeah, we gotta funny putty him? Yeah, he hates his own reflection. Boop. Man, I didn't know you had an excavator oh my. in your room. It's a wrench. Wow. Cool. Is that your crane? Well, I get to drive it, but they won't let me take it home at night. <laughs> Aww. That's the person who definitely should yeah, not take it the home. The boss has a policy about not letting us borrow anything that can be used to knock down his house. <laughs> wow! Well, it's supposed to be used for clearing that junk over there. But one of the control levers got busted and lost. I can move the crane this way. And this way. But without the other lever, I can't pick up that stuff. And it's just piling up. I'll keep my eyes peeled for something we can use as a lever. Thanks a bunch. The sooner I get the crane fixed, the sooner I can go on my coffee break. Ah, spoken that... like a true construction worker. What is with the Hiwagas Entertainment and the construction workers and their coffee breaks? <laughs> this is the second There's game There's a trading card. Let's go. Remote remover. The remote remover breaks into people's homes and steals their TV remotes as a part of his dastardly plan to force them to watch infomercials. Oh no! Oh no, what a fiend! <laughs> The remote remover was featured in issue 271, Ca Channel Chaos, and issue 398, Boredom of Doom. The remote remover tries to conceal one's shocking secret. He cuts his own hair! Good for him. Very he, thrifty. His favorite color is boring gray. Why Honestly, is he stealing it from a rubber duck? Rubber ducks have TV remotes, too. I mean, the, the, honestly, the remote remover is just like, what the heck, 50 bucks for a haircut? I could do it myself! I can't <laughs> say anything. <laughs> No, you I can't. I cut hair, too. You're not your own, though. Not my own. It's a vampire bat! Uh, uh, uh. The sudsy water can't get past this debris. What did you say? Can, can you I speak up? Said, I thought he said the sensitivity of water makes it unable to breathe. That's what I, I thought he said. my lever. Okay. My lever. I want to knock down my boss's house. <laughs> kind of funny. Uh, 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 oh, that's, oh, go, oh, that's a weird hitbox. We're back to the fireflies. I think we... Where are the... Where do we have to go? I'm confused. And then he bounces up. I'm a sponge! I'm a sponge. <laughs> Shut no. up, sponge! Why does everybody leave me up here? <laughs> He's so happy to see Because we have to you. go back. Now we go to Steven Spielberg Grids. <laughs> Okay, Pajama Sam, there's- there's- What- what other movies are in the woods that aren't made by Steven Spielberg? Uh, I guess they don't into exist. The woods. I don't think oh. that's going to work. Hey! Wow! An ice cube! Oh, it I, is an ice cube. I definitely clicked on that earlier. Sock, go get it for me! That wouldn't clean the sock. But it, it's already dirty. Just throw it in there and then we'll put it in then the Then we'll wash. clean it later. Yeah. <laughs> that's not very Make nice. Make the sock do everything. That one? Or is that to the... This is to... Oh, the font. Okay, damn it. I still don't know what the heck that thing is. 
blasted dust bunnies won't hold still long enough for me to catch them. Cool, well, if I catch them, can I steal them and uh, kill them? I don't think that's wise. Well, I guess that's not going to work. What is this stupid net for? We've used it on three things that would make sense. yippee ki -yay. Get over here. Yee-haw! Yee-haw! I lost a little bunny, partner. Much obliged, Sam. And look at here. All the other bunnies are following. Wow, I must have lost the main bunny. Yep, you done did good. Now let's get these bunnies ready for shaving. You shed them and they're Shave gone. It, or are we just gonna like kill them? <laughs> I think we're just gonna kill them, to be honest. Children, look away! Oh, nope, never mind. Just give me no. Oh. Oh, they look like, uh. Dude, you know what they look like? They look like those, um, things from Thousand Year Door. The punies? The punies. They have really big feet. Yeah, the punies don't really have feet. But it's the same Are we just gonna see this 20 up. times? Let's go. <laughs> <'Cause> I love <laughs> The stock lottery it's, sounds. Here's your stock of the yarn. Well, that's dust bunny. That yarn trading card just appeared out Thought of nowhere. Thought you might like some yarn. Yeah. For helping me out with the bunnies. You know what, what I are you? miss from the previous Pajama Sam games that I feel like they they put in at least a couple of them is um they would have like scenes after you complete something important like after you yeah. get the socks or something. Mother like, Nature. Yeah, they had that in two. They definitely had that in three. They didn't have it in one. So three. Didn't they have like some scenes of like the peace delegates? Maybe not. Like, maybe no, only at the end. Maybe oh, oh okay. The gentleman man trading card. With you no did not move open. your mouth at all. <laughs> no mouth open. <gasps> That's for you. No, I just read the last one, didn't I? That oh, yeah. The, remote, remote. the Illuminator Mark V! The Illuminator Mark V emits a brilliant beam of energy to zap bad guys, especially those who cower in the shadows. It's the flashiest weapon around with unlimited range and stylish chrome trim. The Illuminator is powered by special super batteries, size PJ. Oh, yeah. Pajama Man carries it with him everywhere, except when he doesn't need it. Fun fact, an earlier model, the Illuminator Mark IV, had to be replaced with it when it was eaten by the sofa cushion monster. The Illuminator Mark V is, like, the equivalent of those cars that have the headlights that just like reach halfway across the world. That is true. And when you're right in front of them, you're just like, turn off your high beams, and then they like turn on their high beams. And you're like, oh and no. And then like you basically get x-rayed. <laughs> well damn dust bunny. Okay, I don't know. I still don't know what you are, dude. But I, I'm concerned. Don't eat, don't ask stupid questions. He looks like one of the minions like weird uncles. That Beetle. need too many lime popsicles. Okay, we gotta find some way to get... Make this dang scarf. We'll go make the shirt. We can make this... Yeah, but we also need to find some way to get holes in the jar. And we also need to save that sock. Oh, yeah. What do we use for the sock? Can we just use the lasso again? Oh, see! I think we might have been able to actually just climb up at the beginning. Oh, were we dumb? Nope. Any luck on finding a way to get my friend clean? Not yet. Oh, we have to I'm clean him first. Can we just clean him in the fish tank with the sponge? Um, I no, the, the sponge will eat the dirt off of him, Marty. That's not how that works. I don't have socks. What's up this way again? Oh, <laughs> you can get up there. One. Um. One. Um, what is that jump cycle? <laughs> Don't worry about it, Artie. No, I, I am. That's, that's the it issue. looks like... Uh, Yay! <laughs> wow. Then you need to wait longer. Remember the um, Sonic... They did, like, the Sonic episodes on the iPhone and Android. And you could, like, play, like, levels of Green Hill Zone. His cycle for spinning in the air is so bad. Oh. He he doesn't like it's supposed to rotate and then like land on his feet, but he doesn't quite land on his feet, so they had to adjust it right before he lands, so it looks like he's gonna fall over and it's just like <laughs> Oh. Here's some yarn. It's bunny yarn. Oh, 
that's the best kind. Sure it is. It's soft and silky and it knits real fast. Good. I'll knit a shirt just for you. What kind of shirt do you knit? What the heck? Try it on. How? <laughs> I guess I should have left at least one neck hole. Oh dear, this can't possibly fit you. But still, it's a very nice, um, shirt. Thing. I'm so sorry, young man. If only I had a pattern to work from, I know I could make you a fine shirt. I'll get you a pattern to She work created from. another abandoned uh, shirt any object to take care of. No, it has to show your specific size and shape. Let us find a tailor. I know what we can do. Can we funny putty ourselves? This funny putty really stretches. Let's see if I can stretch it to be as tall as me. <laughs> wow. Now my funny putty looks like me. Does that work as a pattern? She should just look at us. I know. Will this do? Oh, but she's gonna cut the fabric up That's to the quite a funny pattern putty, probably. Got there. It's every bit as handsome as you. Aw, oh, gee, thanks. Thanks, Grandma Sweater. Thank you for bringing me such an excellent pattern. One shirt coming right By up. By the way, children, uh, don't funny putty your entire body and then hit yeah. someone. Oh <laughs> my gosh. Like it? it looks just great. Where that to the mall? Thanks for the compliment. <laughs> I like your looks too. I'm not putting my neck oh, through his I mouth. <laughs> I don't think that's where you put me. it on. And vice versa. Gosh, thanks a bunch, Grandma. You're Jim. welcome. Mia. His mom's like, Sam, are you wearing a you shirt made of dust? Right now, don't Sam. worry about Why it. Don't, don't worry about it. When I said get ready for the mall, this is not what I meant, Sam. <laughs> his mom is just like, where is he? <laughs> mall closes in five, five minutes. That's, oh, imagine we had a timer for the game. That'd be bad. <laughs> I thought we had a time limit for Pep's birthday surprise. Well, that's because they put the clock in the corner for no reason. Yeah. Uh, all right. I don't know what to do. Also, I don't know what the light would be for either. All right, dump the sock in and let the sponge eat the dirt off of him. Dingle the sock in there. That's not meant to wash clothes in. Well, it well, was worth too a bad. shot. Well, too bad. How about we lasso the sponge out? That's not something I can put in my jar. I can't use that here. Sure you can. I think I'll hang on to this. Does the sponge serve home. no purpose? <laughs> no, he does. I know he's gotta like do something. He's the Chekhov's gun of the game. He, he eats sure. Dr. Grime at the end, I'm telling you. <laughs> I, I wish he would. I The fact that you're telling me that makes me think it won't. Okay, okay, what do we have in our... Sir? Flashy. Okay, there's gotta be something we can do to cross the lake. Uh, th we put it all in the jar. I don't think that I can scoop that. That's not something okay. I can put peanut. in my jar. The, oh, the peanut, the nutcracker. Chomp, chomp. Where is he? Ages three to eight. I forgot that there was a screen beyond this one. <sighs> Excuse me, Mr. Nutcracker. Hey there, Mr. Nutcracker. My name is Sam, and I have a nut that needs opening. Yes, comrade. I can open any nut. I have opened the nuts for all crowned heads of Europe. Here it is. Thank you much. Peanut is delicious. Here is leftover shell. I put it in my scrapbook if I had one. We're use it as a boat. But I don't. So yeah, I bet that's genius. Could have done this a while ago. Whoops. Do we have him punch holes into the jar? <laughs> no. I only eat peanuts. And maybe a macadamia nut. You know who else eats peanuts? Gloppy. Gloppy. Oh, the molasses swamp. That is a name I have not heard in a long time. Of course I know it. He's me. That was a good game. That was an entertaining game. Preparing to launch peanut boat. This is Pajama Sam, Where's Otto when you need him? He sank. Peanut, ready to sail. Oh, that's kind of dark. <laughs> what? Oh, he like... Did, what was that Zip. animation? There's a trading card. Oh, there is a trading card. Uh, what is me. it? 
<gasps> Captain Gelatin. Captain Gelatin is the founding member of the Lunchboxers. He may wiggle and jiggle, but the bad guys don't laugh when he their sticks and stones bounce right off of him. He gains his strength from his internal marshmallows, of course. Uh, his favorite color is red, although that is not his natural color. Oh. What is his natural color? You probably don't he want to know. He goes to the tanning bed too much. <laughs> <laughs> I was originally lime jello. That would be bad. What are That's the shoes? That's the biggest shoehorn I've ever seen. I bet it's really, really loud. I think. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> okay then. It's all clogged up. Ew, it's full of mold. Ew. No and you put your mouth on that. I bet I know who would love to yeah, go oh, there. Okay. You know what? I have to say, the sock was depressed because he's alone. Look at how sad these socks are in the, 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 the shoes. shoes. They're just like, oh, I don't like my partner. Uh, uh, why are we in the these are These are the ones going through the these messy divorce. These two aren't even looking at each other. They're so upset. Another card. Oh, there's a card. Serious Bowler. One of his arms <laughs> is a bowling... Uh, pin. Pin. The Zurious Bowler is a constant thorn in Pajama Man's side. He likes bowling. He only likes bowling. He wants to remake the world so that everything involves bowling and no one will ever be allowed to stop bowling. Most people would agree that a little bowling is fun, but this guy just goes too far. <laughs> fun fact, the Serious Bowler can eat his own weight in pretzels. <laughs> I think this is my favorite one. It's so weird. <laughs> it's great. He's just, he's like just a normal dude that's obsessed with bowling. You have to be obsessed with bowling too. It's like, no serious bowler. Wow. Stop. Hey, this tree is full of shoes. I guess it's a shoe tree. <laughs> I wonder if they stay up there all the time. I will steal a pair for my own feet. Catch a shoe. Wear a pair, wear a pair, and we'll always be together. I don't think this net is long enough. Is that net used for anything? We picked up this net, but it's not gonna be no, helping us. No, we have to use the net to catch the fireflies once we Lasso get Lasso them out. That's not going Put to the be. shoe in the jar. Sock, talk I to them. Use that here. Put the shoe in the jar. No, we need we need to blow the horn to make knock them down, probably. <laughs> so we gotta backtrack and get that span. What? Oh, I forgot about this room. Ew. That night, though. <laughs> He's so angry. <gasps> Thunder is Lightning's partner in crime when two of them stir up scary bad weather. Thunder always wears rubber-soled sneakers when around Lightning. I do wonder why. Mm. Thunder first appeared in issue 803, the weather wore tennis shoes. Fun fact, Thunder's bicycle is louder than most motorcycle. <laughs> Dane Thunder, Who what a menace. needs a motorcycle bang when you have, uh, the mo motorcycle game when you've got the bicycle gain. <laughs> bicycle gain. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so the king's like, this is going well. The queen is just, like, furious that the bishop can take her. And the rook's just like, just you try. Hello. And then the, the horse the is like, I got kicked out of the game. If you catch my thrift. Oh. Oh. Hello. My name is Sam. Just Sam? I'm Pajama Sam. Hmm. Members of the royal family do not associate with normal people like you. Have fun getting cut out and taken by that night. Okay, okay, okay. only talks to fellow royalty. And then only with an engraved invitation. What does that mean? It means you won't be talking to her. Oh. Let's bring the sponge Let's in Let's take her. Hello. The sponge will have some words. My name's Sam. What do you do? I am a bishop. <laughs> Don Hat. What kind of hat is that? They call it a mitre. I call it a nuisance. Once it fell off and poked me in the toe. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dearie me. Oh, there's a there's a <laughs> nice horsey. Crook, uh, like that thing. Ouch. Does this belong to you? Ah, why, how did that get there? I say, thank thee, young man. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. I got They're taken by the rook. The game must still I be going, I guess. I could have captured, didn't I? Yes, well, I needed to get caught up on my Sunday crosswords anyway. <laughs> All right. What sort of piece is that? It's a rook. And by hook or by crook, there's no way you can talk to a rook. He is just a castle. Hi there. True. Is that a real crown? Well, 
The king is too busy to speak with you. Yes, dear. That, that, <laughs> that is unfortunately... That's so accurate to the game yeah, of chess. it is. <laughs> the queen is the most powerful piece, while the king is just the most important piece. But he kind of sucks on his own. True. The queen is like, I can kill you from halfway across the board. 